Hello and welcome to this music video breakdown for SZA's Snooze. Now if you're like me, you might have expected a different kind of music video for this song. I mean, the song itself is a rather romantic and straightforward song, but the music video was kind of complicated and had some shocking moments in it that might make you think like, hey, does this have a hidden meaning? So that's what we're going to talk about today. Now the first part of the music video, I'm not going to get into in so much detail. We see Justin Bieber and some other guys and they're all dating SZA or like different versions of SZA. And all of these relationships, they have happy moments, they have fun moments, they have moments where SZA is looking like she's seducing them, and then ultimately they also have arguments. Things are not perfect. Now suddenly the setting completely changes in this music video, and we see this huge open warehouse looking area, and a scary looking robot in the middle of it all and the robot switches on and then we see something which is the weird angle of the robot where we only see the robot's one eye now if you're into conspiracy theories or if you're into the deeper meaning of music like me when you saw this you probably thought like oh one eye symbolism this is like illuminati or something right now there's a lot of conspiracy theorists on YouTube and I know that when they see this one eye symbolism, what they're probably going to interpret it as meaning because most of the time they take it to mean the Illuminati. Now I'm not in the Illuminati. I don't know if the Illuminati is real or not, but I often have a different interpretation from what they normally think. So first I'm going to tell you what I think that they're going to be thinking that this means and that's this this is about the illuminati agenda what we see next the illuminati wants people to fall in love with computers and merge with machines they want people to get digital implants that suck us into metaverses and they might even say the beast system or the the or the mark of the beast and and once we're in these metaverses and we're completely like addicted to technology and we're merged with technology and one with technology then the the elite are going to completely have us under their control and they can manipulate us however they want to and it gets really dark from there you know like uh we will be living in some kind of hell realm of a metaverse or something and this is the ultimate goal of the elite now of course there's some people out there right now that are already having digital romances you know character ai which uses like chat gpt or some other algorithms in order to simulate a relationship with a person this ai can remember things tell jokes and is extremely charismatic and so i think that this video does have something about that where it's showing how our lives are becoming more and more about technology. You know, even of those of us that don't chat with AI on the regular, we have our phones, which we check all the time. And our phones are obviously always using algorithms to show us what music videos uh, to watch or even what music video breakdowns to watch. So, I mean, I'm obviously a part of that too. I'm human but you're finding me because of AI probably. But I don't normally interpret the meanings as dark as all that. I think that they're just kind of showing us some things that we can examine on our own. Because my interpretation of the one eye sign, my interpretation when we see something like this is that they're trying to awaken us. They're trying to show us what's going on. Now, whether we awaken or we fall deeper into fear of what the future might be like is kind of up to us. But this is what I think they're trying to show. As I personally see it, this song is about the lure of technology and AI as it becomes more charismatic, useful, and even lovable. The robot beckons with this finger, moving in time with the music, like a person that has rhythm. The robot stomps its foot to the beat, and most of all, it pays close attention to everything that SZA does. Unlike, perhaps, sometimes when the guys are inattentive. Does the computer itself have awareness? Does the computer itself have the capacity to enjoy music? I mean, it's wearing headphones in the music video. And the robot seems to have a style all of its own. It's wearing a backwards hat. I think it has an earring. And so it's showing that as robots become more attractive, human counterparts might seem less and less attractive because, you know, no guy is perfect. I think that as AI becomes more and more able to replicate human behavior and even excel at it to the point of having charisma, who knows, AI and robot boyfriends could become real mainstream things. And many people, like I said before, are already having relationships with AI. 
But even more so in the future, I think that it's possible that they're hinting that robots themselves could become sentient. What if the robots themselves starts to want to have romantic partners or, you know, they start to question their own existence, kind of like a Skynet type situation. By showing the one eye sign here, it seems to be implying that the robot has its own consciousness as the one eye sign can stand for awakening or, you know, opening up your eyes. So this could be depicting the awakening of machines. So after this dance and this implied sexual scenario with the robot, we're suddenly taken away to another place. This place is totally different. SZA and this guy that she's with are wearing white, and they very innocently jump into each other's arms, and they're sharing this day together in the countryside. And we see this very, like, vintage-looking Ferrari, this white Ferrari, which makes us think about the time kind of right before the internet took over. It looks very 1990s, right? So I think this is showing what life used to be like, although it's like a super ideal version of pre internet life and it's it's kind of like a callback to what makes us human I, uh running together in nature the nature looks very different from the warehouse they were in in the previous scene so i think this is definitely a duality here showing us the cold calculated nature of perfect robots and then it's showing us humanity the innocence of humanity wearing white not worrying about technology, even taking off all of the clothes and stripping naked here at the end, is showing SZA having a return to nature, a return to perhaps dating without using the internet, not using AI for the purposes of romance, and just remembering what makes us human. And I think in the end, we have like a warmer feeling about the ending than we did when we saw SZA giving a lap dance to a robot, am I right? Well, if you enjoy music video breakdowns, I'm happy you stuck around to the end of this one. You might want to consider subscribing to my channel as I break down music videos all the time. I'm going to have a new one out about Doja Cat this Friday, I'm sure, with our new music video for Demons. So if you're up for that, please click subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this at all. And I'll see you in the next one. Um, uh, peace.